Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome back Rachel's wonderful assistant, Joe Wilkinson. <laughs> you were circumcised. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, why are you wearing a matador outfit? I've got egg down my suit. <laughs> he's, uh, he's the only other clothes I own. I don't know whether we should stop, cos he's, he's actually got a ladder in his tights, so if they caught that on camera, it could be quite embarrassing. Oh, <laughs> I don't want you to look, look an idiot. If you could just favour the other leg. <laughs> I, uh, I don't use some corned beef sandwiches. Great. Well, um, should I just... Don't well, I don't really eat corned beef. What's the f <laughs> point? <laughs> um, oh, no. Sorry, Joe. I, by the way, I'd like to point out I actually do have genitals. <laughs> See them on either side of your hat. <laughs> Joe? Wow. Why are you wearing a wedding dress, Joe? I'll be honest with you, Jimmy, it's been a bit of a cock up. <laughs> <laughs> well, just talk me through it, Joe. What's happened? <sighs> I had, a, I had a couple of drinks, and I uh, got a text uh, from Rachel. I thought it said, um, will you marry me? Sobered up a bit, reread it, and it said, will you stop texting me? <laughs> <laughs> so now I feel like a bit of a dick. <laughs> Good luck, girls! <laughs> <laughs> it, it just dawned on me as well, Jimmy, if, if we were getting married, I should have just probably worn a suit. <laughs> What is really annoying is I've had the figurines done for the top of the cake. <laughs> that's that's uh, Rachel there. <laughs> she's had a drink, but she's got a calculator there. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's one of me. <laughs> Fabio, Fabio, grab this. Thanks, mate. That's, uh, that's my half brother, Fabio. <laughs> Great body, but thick as pig shit. What's going on? Oh, uh, yeah, I've, uh, I've been promoted again. <laughs> uh, head of youth development, because uh, I'm pretty funky. So, basically, uh, they want to get young people watching the show, because apparently only old people watch this shit. And, uh, <laughs> So I had a couple of choices, a couple of ideas. I could either get uh, the boy band One Direction on the show, uh, you know, do a couple of songs, or I could dress up as a lion. <laughs> yeah, I, I feel I may have made the wrong... <laughs> but it's not too hard. I've got lots of ideas to get them watching. I've got, like, um, got like a nest of tables. <laughs> Look at that. It sort of makes the set look like a sort of cool rapper's bungalow. <laughs> it's quite nice. This is a bit of a clincher. I bought my map of the UK canal system. <laughs> and I thought we could all sort of choose... Can you hold that for a sec? Choose, choose our favourite canal. <laughs> so I thought we'd just do a little talk on that and actually get the party started. <laughs> Until then... <laughs> Yeah! 
Hey, Joe, how have you been? Shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll tell you what's going on, Jimmy. Since you fired me, I'll be honest with you, I've struggled to get work. <laughs> and the only job the job centre could get me in was on a show called The Only Way is Essex. <laughs> so I'm on that now. If you don't know, it's like a drama. It's kind of like Downton Abbey, but they have uh, fantastic teeth and a vacant expression on their faces. <laughs> OK, so you're on TOWIE, but yeah. why are you dressed like that? <sighs> <laughs> you winding me up? <laughs> I'm just asking. Well, well it's because it's if you're going to go on The Only Way is Essex, you have to be glamorous, and what's more glamorous than a mermaid? <laughs> Aren't mermaids normally fish from the waist down? <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, Jimmy, what, just while we're here, while we've got the cameras, do you mind if I quickly film a scene for one of the episodes? Do you mind? Yeah, I do mind, yeah. Brilliant. Can we, <laughs> this bit here, can we make it into, like, a tasteful Essex wine bar? <laughs> 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 I did say tasteful, Fabio, you f <laughs> Oh, we'll have to get my co-star on. Ladies and gentlemen, Lauren Goodyear! <laughs> right, Lauren? You all right? Yeah, yeah I'm all right. Yeah, you look nice. Thanks, so do you. All right, don't get sulky. <laughs> do you want a drink? Uh, yeah, I've half a pint of mild, please. Half a pint of mild, please, Fabio. That's, uh, that's my half-brother, Fabio. He's got a great body, but he's f thick. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, love. It's uh, half Thanks. a pint of mild. Should we do the scene, then? Come on, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> right, here we go. I think we should split up. You bastard. I'm sorry, but the sex is dog shit. Are you mugging me off? <laughs> Are you here for Rob? <laughs> <laughs> what have you been up to? Since I uh, got fired from the last show, you prick. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> a lot of spare time on there, hasn't I? I haven't been wasting it. I've been uh, attempting quite a few world records, and it's going bloody well, actually. <laughs> like, for example, I uh, currently hold the world record for the person dressed as a toothbrush for the longest. <laughs> uh, six days. Six days. I really, really need a piss now, though. <laughs> uh, but I've been doing loads of them uh, with my half brother Fabio. He's uh, he's got a great body, as you can see, but he's dangerously thick. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll show you why. At the moment, Fabio here has the world record for the world's shittest back tattoo. <laughs> the U-bend of a sink. <laughs> oh, mate, that is <laughs> appalling. <laughs> oh, you'll like this one, Jimmy. Myself and Fabio, we currently hold the record for the world's rudest car airbag. It uh, says you're an anus when you crash, which I think is a lovely little feature. <laughs> and finally, but by no means least, uh, we have the record for the world's grooviest beehive. Mm -hmm.